Hey everyone, what's up? It's TechRack here with my first tutorial and today I'll be showing you how to rename your music files so if, for example if you download an album online you can see here I've got 12 songs but at the start of each song it saves a number like 01, 02, 03, 04 now if, for example if you download like 20 albums um, they all have numbers so in your music player you can't play them alphabetically and if you want to rename them one by one it takes quite a lot of time uh, so today I'll be showing you how you can do it in less than a minute all at once so the first thing you want to do is open up your internet then you want to search for tag and rename it's the first one and click download now this is a trial but um, you can use it and then buy the real one if you like so if you open it click run install it and um, choose whatever you want I'll choose no um, no, it default next, next, and then once it's installed, um, you can open it. And now it's reading my music library, and click, click I agree. And now you can see in my own music library, I've already used this program before, and it's all alphabetical. There's no numbers at the start of anything. Um, and so t I'm going to be renaming this folder here so if I go and browse onto my desktop um, should be a fo there we go 80s 80s and heartbreak so you want to select this all and click preview and here you can say that before rename after rename and all these numbers will go so if you click rename there you can see all of these have been renamed and just to prove it to you if you open it they've all been changed and um, this is quite useful for if you want to rename loads of them at once like in my mp3 player um, all of these have been renamed and um, as far as I'm aware these this only renames music files um, so yeah this program is really useful if you want to rename all your music files and it lets your music player play stuff in alphabetical order so I really recommend this program if you need it um, thanks for watching my tutorial and I hope you found it useful